What's that time of the year and dry ice is super popular and you're going to find dry ice, believe it or not, at probably your local grocery store. Just ask the customer service uh, counter where the dry ice is and they're probably going to send you to a chest that looks like this. Here's what it looks like inside. Always start with the gloves because dry ice is 110 degrees Fahrenheit below zero. It's about 78 degrees Celsius below zero. So a big chunk like this is about 10 pounds. That's going to be pretty good. I'm not going to use all of it today. And so I'm going to buy a little bit extra because remember it turns into a gas. Well, the next thing you need to do is to store it properly. And I would suggest going to the store and taking one of these coolers, a very inexpensive styrofoam cooler. Believe it or not, that's the secret to keeping dry ice. This cooler here will keep the dry ice for about 24 hours and you're only going to lose about 30 or 40 percent and it seems like a lot but that's great for the dry ice. Don't go and put this in your freezer because you'll actually trick your freezer into thinking that it's too cold and it will shut off and then you'll ruin all your food. So just keep it in the chest. The styrofoam is a perfect insulator for it and uh, you're ready for your Halloween activities.